Hi everyone, it's Kelly J, and today I want to share with you a quick morning routine. Um, it's the morning routine that I, I, I pretty much use every morning. I tweak it a little bit here and there, um, but the one thing I do um, differently some days is I wear my LED mask for 20, 20 minutes, just right after I get up um, from get out of bed. I cleanse my skin and I pop that LED mask on and I use it on three different settings, the red, um, the red, the blue, and the yellow. And then my skin's ready to kind of receive product. Um, I start with the ginseng toner and then I'm going to share in this video all of the quick serums I use and why I use them, why I love them, and how effective they are. But my main point in this tutorial today is to show you how beautiful our tinted moisture balm is SPF 36 and it's full of antioxidants and um, I hope that if you enjoy this video that you'll link right below or right below and um, give me a thumbs up and also um, subscribe and uh, we bring you tips and tricks um, from Jolie Visage Skincare that's our brand, and Jolie Day Spa. We are a skin clinic in Southern California, Marietta, California, um, and we post on Instagram daily, and um, I'll link everything below, and we appreciate you watching our video, bringing you tips and tricks and things that we do at our spa that will help you maintain and reverse damage and correct your skin. Um, it's all about creating changes is my little motto and bringing you product that is very affordable luxurious with active ingredients um, And you don't have to pay the price uh, for products that are three four or five times as much as ours maybe more so um, I appreciate you um, watching this video and I um, I'll get started Okay, so I have just um, I've just cleansed my skin this morning. I cleanse with AHA um, uh, exfoliating cle exfoliating cleanser, and um, I have sprayed my skin um, several times with ginseng toner. And I am now going to show you a quick morning routine. And I also um, really want to share with you how beautiful our um, tinted moisture bombs are um, and how they're filled with active ingredients and antioxidants. They're really amazing for the skin. So what I'm gonna start out with first is, I'm just gonna do a little neuropeptide here. Um, and I'm gonna spot treat around my eyes. The neuropeptide, for those of you that are new to the channel, um, the neuropeptide has seven, seven peptides in it, um, and it has niacinamide, and the peptides uh, are in the product for different reasons. Some uh, some help with skin repair. Some of them, um, some of the peptides are for relaxing fine lines. Some of them are for uh, collagen stimulation. And I will link um, a a video on the specific peptides that are in that neuropeptide. But the inspiration uh, behind that neuropeptide was just that I saw so many expensive brands that were selling their products for hundreds of dollars. So we had ours formulated and it's even better. It has more peptides than I'd say 90% of um, products online um, and by well-known doctors and brands. It's just amazing. Um, so anyways, that's the neuropeptide I'm going to start with um, this morning. And then I am going to go ahead and put some of our Rectify and Retinoate. As you know, this is, um, this is a product that is um, a very mild form. No, 
I, I'm gonna restate that. It's a very wonderful form of retinol, but in the form of retinoate. And retinoate is active like uh, a retinol or retin-A without, without the irritation. So you can use this on a daily basis it has skin brighteners in it, has daisy, uh, daisy extract, flower extract. It has calming ingredients. And the retinol does its job um, like a high performance form of, of, of retinol, like a retin A, but without the irritation. So you can use that liberally and you can use it every day. Um, now I am also going to show you our new hyaluronic molecule serum I'm pretty excited about this one another formula that has active hyaluronic in it but in the form of um, hyaluronic cross polymer which is a way of formulating uh, retinol I mean sorry hyaluronic um, so that it lasts longer it's not an animal animal derived hyaluronic it's just a long longer lasting form of hyaluronic that will stay in your skin and keep it moist all day long. It's a, it's a, it's a, actually a better form of just your, your plain hyaluronic acid. Um, that hyaluronic acid, uh, is, uh, it has MSM that is skin conditioning and, uh, skin reparative. Um, it has a really nice, very nice consistency. It's not a thin base. Um, it has, it has some weight to it, but feels very refreshing and goes right into the skin. So those are my three that I'm going to layer that are water-based. We call that, um, hydrophilic. And then I'm going to finish just for a really great antioxidant, um, uh, layer. I'm going to do a lipophilic um, product, and this is our turmeric, our vitamin C and turmeric facial oil, um, and this turmeric is just absolutely beautiful. It has um, tetra tetrahexadecyl, which is a, a, a really, a really high performing form of vitamin C. And the reason it performs better than, like, let's say ascorbic acid is because t we call it THD, tetrahexadecyl ascorbate. Um, it has the ability to, um, to deliver the vitamin C um, through our oil, through the lipids. Um, versus an ascorbic acid that is uh, doesn't have that ability to work through uh, the lipid lipid barrier in our skin. So we're getting um, with our vitamin C turmeric facial oil, we're getting um, an, an, a, a form of vitamin C that's really working in into the layers um, and and. Oh gosh, what I say, migrating down into the lower layers of the skin, delivering that very strong antioxidant um, protection in um, you know high performance uh, ingredient, which is THD. Um, and then we have the turmeric, which is turmeric is calming. It's an ancient ingredient that calms and protects. Um, and so this is just a, a really high performing facial oil and that's our vitamin C and turmeric facial oil. And that's great for daytime because you're getting those, that added, added benefit of, um, protecting from the environment with all the strong anti, the, the high performance antioxidants in the product. And it just is going to hold that moisture in the skin. One thing that I love, um, I forgot to. Do, do my neck. So while I do my neck, I'll let you know um, what I was just about to share. Um, one thing that I really love about layering serums um, is that when you're putting on your 
water-based serums, your hydrophilic products, um, they're going to go right into the skin. Um, they are, um, they're going to, they're going to be fine when you layer them. And so they're just absorbing right into the skin. And then we're going to, we're going to add that, that lip, lipophilic product with the vitamin C turmeric. And I feel like that just is so important to occlude the skin. Um, not just smother it, but to occlude like, uh, it's kind of like, uh, the icing on the cake. It holds all that, not cake, but it holds all that, those active ingredients from the water-based products in the pores, deeper into the epidermis, the, the mid part of the skin. And then we put that really beautiful glow serum, the vitamin C with turmeric. And I'm just gonna stay very hydrated um, all day long. And I'm not, I'm not going to see that dryness or irritation. Um, and it, you know, those are, those are really nice serums we've layered with the neuropeptide, um, addressing all the fine lines, uh, correcting the niacinamide that creates an energy in the skin. You can feel a flush when you use the niacinamide or the neuropeptide. Um, and then the retinol with retinoate, non-irritating, but it's still delivering that really a high performance form of, of retinol, ret, retinoate, um, which is really a, the, the uh, it's a really important uh, new ingredients, ingredient uh, as far as um, vitamin A is concerned right now. And then we do our hyaluronic uh, molecule serum with that, with the um, hyaluronic cross polymer, um, the MSM, and then what was the other active ingredient in the, um, hyaluronic molecule serum. Oh, it was um, arginine, which is amazing for um, for calming. Um, and then it was also um, vitamin C and also uh, vitamin E. So the formula um, hyaluronic serum is just one of the best on the market. I'm so pleased with it. So that is it for my morning routine. And I can do that pretty quickly. Um, I'm going to layer, I'm going to layer our um, AM cream now. And this is a product that I absolutely love. And this is from South Korea. And the brighteners in this product are just amazing and it has ingredients that stimulate collagen so I really make sure I work that around my lips and around my eyes um, it is uh, it's lightening it's um, a wrinkle treatment for daytime and um, it's a very high, high performance, professional, medical grade daytime cream. Um, so that is my morning routine. And now I am going to show you our, um, our tinted moisture balm. So I just want to do kind of a simple look today. I don't really feel like putting a lot of foundation on. And so I'm excuse me I'm gonna grab for I'm gonna grab our tinted moisture balm here and it comes in three shades it comes in a light a medium and a deep I'm going to use a little bit of the deep just just for some contour and I'm gonna use um, the medium for all over my skin a lot of our clients are ordering this and they just they absolutely, absolutely love um, feeling as if they have enough coverage for daytime, and they're they're also um, seeing a beautiful finish um, without 
having to put a heavy foundation on. And a lot of them say that they just feel, they just feel really fresh just using our tinted moisture balm. On the other hand, if you wanted to use tinted moisture balm to set your foundation, it's a beautiful finish. Um, so I'm going in with a little bit of a deeper shade of red in here, the deeper, the deeper color. So I did medium all over my skin. Now I'm going in with the deep, just right here in my cheekbones. The end of the nose, little contour here. It's very, it's very subtle, but it just gives me enough, enough contour that I'm happy with it for the daytime. Sometimes I feel like less is more, and I'm finding that wearing less foundation actually makes my skin look really fresh and clean. Um, so that's the tinted moisturizer. It has vitamin E. It has uh, ascorbic. Uh, it has uh, tocopherol acetate, and it has um, vitamin E. Um, no, tocopherol acetate is vitamin E. It has pomegranate pomegranate extract, and it has very soothing um, uh, ingredients in it with an SPF 36. And it just gives a really beautiful finish that I just am really enjoying, especially for summertime when I'm just on the go. So I'm going to show you how pretty this is just for a little added benefit. This is one of the lipstick colors I was thinking I, was thinking I wanted to launch, and it's actually become one of my new favorites. Um, and then I just put a little bit of the Milani, I think this is the Milani or Revlon, um, and it's called Prismatic Peach, number 03. It's Milani. It's, it's Milani. It's not, it's not um, Revlon. And then I just put a little bit. over that lipstick. And I'm kind of crazy. I saw this beautiful blush that reminded me of some very high-end blushes. Um, and I saw this on YouTube, a really great Instagram, not Instagram, YouTuber. Um, and she, what is her name? Um, oh boy, I'll link it down below she mentioned this blush and it's a Revlon blush. It's just a beautiful shade of like a peach, peachy pink. And I'll just come up here a little bit higher on my cheekbones for some color. And that's it. And what I feel like um, with Tinted Moisture Balm is it's a really nice alternative to have fresh looking skin, to have hydrated skin. Um, it doesn't accentuate fine lines. It, um, it has really good coverage. Um, it stays on the skin all day. Uh, it doesn't absorb into the skin. Um, so I think it's just a really nice alternative to um, like a, an SPF that's uh, that's um, just a chemical uh, SPF. And so um, I wanted to share that with you and they come in three different shades. They come in the, in the um, also a clear shade, but they come in a light, a medium, and a deep. And it's kind of fun to play around with, you know, a light medium or a medium deep and you can kind of get some little high, highs and lows in the skin without, you know, it looking like it's obviously um, a uh, contour color. But it does give some definition. 
And that's fine with me because I think a natural look sometimes is just a youthful, fresh look. So I hope this has helped you a little and that I've been um, uh, able to t share with you why I love the Tinted Moisture Balm SPF 36. Um, it's really good for your skin and um, I'm going to link below um, the products that I used, even the product from Revlon and the product from Melania. No, Milani, not Melania, Milani. Um, and I really appreciate you watching and um, I will look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thank you.